only got uh, three and a half thousand feet now. It's uh, man, it's been a struggle. The forecast was supposed to be epic, but uh, I've got some uh, ibis and an eagle that join me. Well, I joined them um, quite low. I like I was probably only I don't know 100 feet above circuit height. Um, but right next to the field um, I managed to climb up with them but uh, even now even even up here it's still this lift here but uh, it's kind of weird lift as you can see it's very overcast everywhere and if we get up touch base with these clouds we might start to get somewhere but uh, Yeah, it's not 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 nicer being higher now than it is. Um, Golf Uniform or Golf Bravo Echo is up here. Um, they took a high tow to 4,000 or something. They're just off to the right. Um, oh, they were they're over that way. He's still cruising around the right. He's still higher than me. So. Um, I'll try going under this cloud a bit more. It's really hard to know where the lift is associated with this. It doesn't really seem to bear um, much uh, to do with the clouds, but but we'll treat playing with it and seeing. Um, Stuart landed. He was up. He was higher than me. I thought he was getting away. And then um, next thing I know, he was he was on the ground. So I think it's a bit of a luck of the draw day. It'd be interesting to see what happens if we can get up under these clouds. Keep trying. Well, we got to, got to cloud base. We're just stooging around here. Tried climbing up the side of a cloud there. Got a little bit up the side of it, but not a lot. But um, I have to say, the sky looks pretty grim. Had a big jet go past before that I think is to do with the Air Force. Um, I think Stuart's taken a relight, but he's not talking at the moment, so he's probably quite busy down there. I think he'd be lucky to get up at the moment with the um, overcast, how it is. You never know, some of this stuff might be connecting from those clouds, but man, it's really scrappy, weird stuff. I don't know, I can either go down to that cloud, I guess that cloud must be working. Or I can, I don't know, <laughs> that doesn't look very good up that way, does it? This is a big dark cloud there that looks like it's not doing anything. There's another one over towards Mount Alford over on the right hand side that kind of looks alright but it's probably a fair way away I think probably my best bit at the moment is just hang around under these clouds wait and see if things move across and we get more sunlight or something going on because otherwise I can't see a lot happening it's just a big thick overcast predicament. We tried pushing forward, <laughs> dark, gloomy, not good. So we're heading back towards the field. I'm trying to sort of stay in one spot, hoping that the sun will come more. I mean, there's sun over to the right here at the moment, but it's followed by another big shadow, so um, I don't know what the answer is. We'll head back towards the field, but <laughs> at least we can land if we have to. Um, I was down to, I don't know, four or five hundred feet above glide so time to turn around so it definitely wasn't the epic day that was forecast but never mind we've had uh how long have we had nearly two hours so can't complain of that a couple of hours flying around round and round and round which is what we've done 